I don't know what it was, whether it was something like divine intervention, but I feel like there was something that brought us together that day. That's a good thing, too. A life in her hand. How that teen reached out with compassion and saved a man's life. We're going to make that our big story tonight. Attend a split-second decision helped save a man's life as he stood on an interstate overpass. A teen girl and her brother spotted him as they were driving by. Fox 6's Ashley Sears is live. And Ash, tonight, they are being called heroes. Yeah, that's right, Ben. They were driving down Layton when they saw that man on the bridge. Without hesitation, they pulled over, and the 15-year-old girl was able to talk him down from the ledge. I'm like, oh, my gosh, this guy's going to jump. Jake Duncan and his sister, Ava Bell, never expected this detour on their drive home Tuesday afternoon. As I'm looking in my rear view, I see him hop over the fence, and at that point, I freaked out. They pulled over on the Layton Avenue Bridge over Interstate 94. Ava Bell hopped out of the car and ran toward the man. So the first thing I did was climb up on the bridge with him. She faced him eye to eye trying to calm him down. I kind of thought of like the Titanic when Rose was like standing over the like Titanic and Jack kind of got up there with her. Building a rapport, she asked him to slip his hands through the fencing. And when he did that, I kind of held onto his hands. For close to 15 minutes, she stood with him until eventually he climbed over to her side. I was terrified with him, but like I was super calm, like on the outside. Her brother called 911 and ran to them. Together, the three walked to safety. I told him, look, you can't, you shouldn't take your life because there's always opportunities in life. They were met by Milwaukee police and sheriff's deputies, and the man was taken to a hospital. A brother and sister thankful to be in this place at that exact moment. So I feel like I don't know what it was, whether it was something like divine intervention, but I feel like there was something that brought us together that day. Now, Ava Bell has no training for these situations. She says she thought back to a documentary that she once watched that explained the importance of touch. She says that's why she grabbed that man's hands that day. Her and her brother are just so grateful that he's alive. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ashley Sears, Fox 6 News. It's amazing. He might not have come over to this side of the fence if someone else ran up to him. Maybe it was fate. Ashley, thank you.